So at Monsanto, we have uh, publicly committed to um, a sustainability initiative, which uh, in essence says that we're going to double yields by the year 2030, uh, and at the same time uh, conserve resources required to, uh, to reach that improvement in productivity. Um, so the ways that we'll get there, uh, the ways that, that a farmer will be able to uh, increase productivity to that level is going to take a combination of things. So not only is Monsanto working on new technology uh, that's going to provide better insect protection, better weed control, uh, improved uh, drought tolerance and things of that nature, um, but there's also agronomic practices and improvements that can be made in that arena. And farmers are doing a great job of that today and really uh, being innovative and in looking at these new traits and when they come out, understanding, you know, what can we do differently now with these traits to increase our yields versus what we were planting uh, two, three, or even four years ago. So the, uh, the practices will be very important, the technology will be very important, and other inputs, looking at how do you use uh, a fungicide such as Headline from BASF to understand, you know, what increases in yield we can see from applying uh, a timely fungicide. And so those are all things that we're committed to in understanding every input that's necessary, every ag agronomic practice that can be improved, and at the same time delivering new technology efficiently to the growers uh, over the next couple of seasons. So today, um, actually in 2000, the national average in corn uh, was about 150 bushels per acre. And so we're saying by the year 2030 that the national average, um, we aspire to be 300 bushels. So in order to get that, um, that level of production, um, we have some technologies on the market today that are going to help us, uh, you know, as more growers adopt those traits, increase productivity across the entire U.S. Uh, then we bring in a product like uh, SmartStacks, which is going to offer growers multiple modes of action above ground and below ground for insect protection and incorporate more uh, options for weed control management. Uh, when you do that, there's the opportunity to reduce refuge. Uh, so today we've requested a refuge reduction down to 5% in the Corn Belt with smart stacks. And when you get to that level, uh, you can now, a farmer can protect a lot more acres. He can protect up to 95% of his farm with the advanced technologies that are, uh, we're really seeing yield improvements from. So you combine those level of technologies that are really reducing stress on the plant, and then you start looking at drought tolerance that's coming. Uh, more efficient uh, nitrogen utilization by the plant, uh, intrinsic yield technologies, uh, traits that um, mitigate cold tolerance, uh, all really uh, step changes in yield that are going to help us eventually get to um, the potential to produce 300 bushel corn across the entire U.S.